here's something you should consider if you run into a situation like this where you need to nail a strap on to a post and a beam, something to make the connection. And it's always going to be best to center the strap. Make sure that the center of the strap is at the breaking point or the point that the two pieces um, meet. In this case, it would be the top of the post and the bottom of the beam. Um, so realistically, I went ahead and I drew a couple of pictures to provide you with a couple of different scenarios. This, of course, would be the situation we're currently looking at right now. And I, I put a little black mark on the strap. The gray rectangle represents the strap. And of course, you can see it's not even close. So what I think I think would be better is if you actually raised the strap up um, before you nailed the blocks, the ridge blocks in, in this case here, I'm using this example, and then just bent the top of the strap over and nailed it onto the beam. So you would have had a strap that was centered um, in the middle, right where it needed to be, um, at the top of the post and the bottom of the beam, and then of course on the top you would have you would have bent the strap over and then continued nailing it into the beam. Even if you would have needed to bend the strap over one last time and nailed it in to the other side of the beam. However, there is another alternative. You could actually nail the strap to the block too. So you'd be nailing it to the beam and to the post and to the block. However, I'm only speculating here. If you run into a case like this and you're not sure what you need to do, um, you would need to check with your structural engineer before doing any of this. I'm just providing you with something that makes more sense, kind of like common sense, which is what a lot of things in the construction industry all boil down to anyway. You might have an engineer, and I've ran into this before, I've had engineers tell me that I shouldn't do one thing, and when I point out to them another alternative they've never thought about before, they get to learn something also. Um, so would it be better to do something like this? In my opinion, it would, because the strap realistically isn't going to be doing um, its job or the job it was going to be designed to do originally if it isn't going to be centered in between the break. And uh, I'm sure most structural engineers would uh, agree with that also.